Hey guys, this is part two of Moderna vaccine second dose. Yep. Um, <clears throat> I hope you guys have watched part one. So I'm still, I still feel like crap. I've resorted to an ice pack on my arm and on my head because my head is killing me. Uh, last time I took a temperature, it was 100.5. Um, I took two Motrin, and it hasn't done anything for it. Um, I'm achy. My joints ache. My damn hand is starting to hurt for some reason. It's just my hand is, like, really, really achy. Um, and one of the things I noticed is at the shot site... Um, I got this because I got this big, I got this big knot. Oh my! And I, don't, I don't think you can see it, but I got this big knot here, and it really hurts. But one of the things I noticed there is every now and then I get like a shooting pain um, in my arm. And just keep in mind, my arm hurts all the way down, and my shoulder hurts, uh, my shoulder blade hurts, and. Yeah, that's kind of where I'm at right now. I'm still very nauseous. I eat something, I'm nauseous. If I don't eat something, I'm nauseous. You know, I guess it doesn't really matter because anything I eat runs through me. Um, so, yeah, all I'm doing is staying hydrated and trying to keep cool if I can get my temperature down. Um, I got my temperature down once today, and then I got really chilled, and so I took a shower, <laughs> which probably wasn't a good idea, but I, I enjoyed it. I had to, mentally, I had to do it. It, it was crazy. Um, so, yeah, that's where I'm at. I'll post more updates. I hope you guys have watched the first video of my first shot, the first dose. Um, I hope you watched the first video of part two. I'm sorry, of the, the, my first video, part one of the second dose. Um, so today is still January the 21st, and it's a little bit after 4. It's about 4.05. And it's been uh, 1, 2, 3. It's been about 20, about 30-something hours. <laughs> uh, I can't count. That's not what I'm here for, guys. I'm not here to count. You know, if you want to know math or something like that, then you you go consult a, a, an electrical engineer because that's that's not my forte. It's not why I'm here, guys. I hadn't lost my sense of humor. So I'll be posting another video in a little bit, guys. Just an update of what's going on. And yeah, this does hurt. It really does hurt. <sighs> This feels good, but I can only stand it for so long. So, all right, guys. I'll holler at you later. I'll, I'll post some updates as time goes on. All right. I'll holler at you guys later. Y'all take care and be safe. Bye-bye. Mm, I'm back. I forgot to tell you guys something. Another symptom that I have. Um, I don't know if you can hear it, but my throat is sore. My throat is getting sore. I rehydrate, I drink water. Um, I don't know what's going on. It's like there's a frog in there or something. I wish you'd go hop somewhere else. So I just wanna let you know I've got that going on too. That's another symptom that's going on is that my throat is hurting. So, all right guys, I'll watch you later. All right. Hey guys. Um, it is six o'clock. Wow, six o'clock. Yeah, it's six o'clock, uh, January 21st. And, um, my head still hurts really bad. My fever came down. I got some food cooking right now, so I'm gonna try to eat while I can. I'm not that nauseous now. There's my soup. Um, yeah, my arm all the way down so far. I've been putting an ice pack on it. Seems like it's cooling it off a little bit. 
but it's still like a big old knot in here, man. It's it's crazy. Let me show you. Uh, Snoopy got the not Snoopy, but Charlie Brown. You see my tattoo. Charlie Brown got the shot in his eye. So hope you can see that. But yeah, it's really really sore and it hurts. Um, I'm still achy. I wish my headache go away. My headache go away, I'd be doing like 95% better. My joints hurt. I'm tired. So yeah. So all right. So here's the deal. I'm going to I'm gonna eat and then probably go to bed. Or try to go to bed. If anything changes, guys, I'll do another video. Um, but I don't think anything's gonna change. Um tonight anyway so all right i'll see you guys in the morning y'all take care be safe bye bye hey guys today is um january 22nd 2021 and just give you a quick update i um it's going on about 9 30 um I'm still running a mild fever. My arm still hurts. It's not as bad as it was before. I do feel I do feel better. Um, I still have a headache. I'm still a little achy. Um, <clears throat> my throat doesn't hurt anymore. I don't know what was going on with it. I had like a frog in my throat or something. It was crazy. Um, yeah, everything seems to be going good right now. Um, my fever's come down. I still have a mild fever though. And finally last night my fever broke and I was able to get some sleep. So I, I've been sleeping, oh, over 12 hours, I guess. I took a bunch of medicine last night. I took Motrin, um, took another blood pressure pill, took some aspirin, took a BC powder from aches and pains and I just lay down and went to sleep. So um, I called in to work today. I called, I, I actually reached out to the hospital and um, they said because of the way I'm feeling and because I have a fever that I'm still not allowed to come back at this point. Um, and I'm, I'm pretty hopeful that everything, I, it's Friday, so I've got, you know, the next, two days off. So I got Saturday and Sunday and I don't have to be back to work on Monday. So I'm thinking that, um, uh, I'll be right as rain come Monday morning. So, um, I'll post more updates if anything, if anything changes, but as is right now, I mean, I still have a little bit of a knot. My shoulder still hurts. Um, it doesn't hurt up here anymore on my back like it used to. Um, the arm doesn't completely hurt. Um, <clears throat> sorry, I keep saying, um, it's a bad habit. I'm working on it though. I, I know you guys have, have picked up on it and noticed it. it I, I have too, so I'm trying to correct myself. I don't say it as often. I know that's related completely to the shot. As you can tell, my sense of humor is up. So, uh, that's all I got guys. Everything's going good. Um, here we go with that um shit again. If anything changes, I'll let you guys know. I'll shoot another video out to you and give you an update. I did post part one of this video, if you haven't watched it yet, of the second dose Moderna. I did post that one today. So that one should be up and running. You should be able to watch that one. And I will post this one when I get around to it. So, all right, guys. Hey, have a great day. You guys take care. I'll let you later. Bye-bye. Back with another update. Aren't you guys excited? Um, my headache's almost gone. My arm still hurts. I haven't. I'm having trouble breathing a little bit. I'm probably gonna have to go do a breathing. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, I'm probably gonna have to go do a breathing treatment. <clears throat> um what else oh 
Um, I'm crapping everything. <laughs> Anything I eat now is just like running through me. It's like, <sighs> yeah. Sorry guys, I was having a hard time breathing. So I'm probably going to go do a breathing treatment and uh, I'll be back with you. It's 2.15. Uh, 22nd of January so yeah I'm tired too so all right guys I appreciate you guys watching me I'll be back at you bye bye hey guys I'm back one update <clears throat> I um I had a breathing treatment I'm breathing a lot better now I feel better um <clears throat> My arm still hurts. I'm still running to the bathroom every 20, 30 minutes. Um, did manage to eat something. I'm hoping, hoping to keep that in. Go down a little seafood place down there and got something. So, um, I had a headache, mild headache. My arm still hurts. I got a knot here on my arm. Um, I'm not, I'm achy in certain places, like my lower back and stuff is achy. Um, my joints, like my knee and stuff, but besides that, everything else is fine as far as the aches go. <clears throat> I also wanted to, you know, let you guys know that there have been other people that have had problems with this shot. There have been other people, especially with the second dose, that they say for some reason the second dose is just affects people um, more than the first one. And, you know, I've been talking to, of course, I work at a hospital, and I've been talking to employee health and stuff, and they, um, they actually have been sending people home uh, from the hospital, nurses and, and other staff, because they... They've had, you know, reactions to the shot, to the second dose. Um, the same stuff I got going on, headaches, aches, um, <clears throat> fever, which is a big thing too. So, um, of course, I'm off for the next two days. It's still Friday, January 22nd. And it's going on 5.45 right now. So, um, I'll, I'll do another update. I'll, I probably won't do another one today. I'm, I'm getting a little tired. I'm probably going to go lay down and try to get some sleep while I can. Um, but besides that, everything else is going fine, guys. I'm, I'm in good spirits. I feel good. You know, mentally, I feel good. <laughs> Even though I may not feel good physically. I still recommend people getting a shot. I still recommend people going down and getting, getting the Biden vaccine. Um, I think it's a good thing to do. So, yeah. All right, guys. I will holler at you later, let you know how, how everything's going. So I appreciate you watching. Bye-bye. Hey, guys. Good morning. It is, where are my glasses? It's 6.09. It's 6.09. January. <clears throat> it's been a long weekend, so you got to bear with me. January 25th. <laughs> it has been, um, Six days, going on six days almost since I got my shot, since I got my second dose of the Moderna vaccine. Um, as you can see, I got my scrubs on. I got up this morning, I'm ready for work. Um, fever's gone, aches and pains are gone. Um, my arm still hurts. I still have maybe a little bit of a knot left. Um, I'm back to my usual self. I'm saying um every, every five seconds for some reason, nice. Since humor's up, I got up this morning, took a shower. I'm feeling fine. <clears throat> this weekend, my 
stomach has just been, ugh, just mad at me completely and utterly. It's still not 100% back to where it needs to be, but, you know, I'll deal with it. So, yeah, um, I feel like I've lived through it. I also, I also want to, you know, some final thoughts on this shot. Um, <clears throat> if you're able to get it, I recommend getting it. I don't know the difference between the Pfizer and the Moderna. I know they work about the same, but I don't know side effects or anything like that. Um, and you have to understand anything in life is a risk. And in my, in my profession, since I work in a hospital, I don't need to take that risk and I don't need to put patients at risk either. You know, so if they're offering vaccines, um, then I need to be taking it. Like I get the annual flu shot. They give them to me free. I'm like, Hey, I'll take it, you know, cause I don't want to get the flu and I certainly don't want to give it to somebody. And that's the same way with this COVID. It was one of the reasons I took it is that I don't want to get it and I don't want to give it to somebody. <clears throat> and plus it helps me at work because if I don't get it, it they limit me on, what, on certain things I can do. Uh, because of it. Um, I don't know if I said this before, we had some people at work, some, some other employees at work at the hospital that actually um, had symptoms, had side effects from taking the, the second dose. Uh, they had a few that had to go home because of high fever. Um, a lot of them complained about the headache and stuff, which my headache is like 97% better. Uh, yeah, so I, I give the the Biden vaccine two thumbs up. I recommend that you go get it if it's available for you. I don't know if children should take it <clears throat> because, because of some of the side effects. I, I think what we're going to see over probably the next year or two, <clears throat> or probably the next six months is they're probably going to come out and start uh, modifying this this actual vaccine um, in a sense that they're going to have probably lower doses for uh, people that are high risk of side effects or even getting the, the COVID virus. Uh, they're probably going to modify it for children. They're probably going to modify it. They may even come out with a version for infants. I, I don't know. Um, but this is just my theory on 2021 and what's going to happen. <clears throat> just don't expect to not wear a mask for the next three years. That's my logic. That's my thinking. Um, the government passing laws or passing whatever codes, ordinances to say you got to wear a mask. Um, even if everybody, everybody in the United States get the, gets the vaccine, they're still going to require people to wear a mask. I mean, masks are pretty much here to stay. So find you a good looking one and wear it all the time. Then you'll be set. I have no problems wearing a mask. I don't wear a mask. I, I live alone. Who am I going to give it to? Snoopy. Um, <clears throat> and if you notice, things may look a little different around me. It's because I um, I felt good enough this weekend to rearrange furniture, and I'm gonna feel a lot more comfortable here. So yeah, that's my recommendation: is to go down and get the shot. Go down and get the vaccine. Um, suffer through it. Know that you're not going to die. The chances of you dying are very slim. Um, they may be altering it soon to give different different doses. I know they'll probably be doing um, some variations down the road. I think the virus will eventually mutate. Um, in the sense, we'll just get different strands and stuff like that. Uh, so I'll probably, it's maybe an annual thing. So we'll probably have to continue to do it. But I don't think that any of the other shots that I get are going to be, you know, if I have to get booster shots, I don't think any of those are going to be as bad as, as the second dose that I got. So, but if they are and I start having symptoms, hey, I can make another video and, you, and let you guys know. I hope this was, I hope this whole experiment, this whole thing was educational for you guys. It's just something I felt I need to do. There was a lot of misconception out there. There's a lot of stuff floating around. People don't know what's truthful, what's not truthful. I mean, even I, I work in the medical field. I, I don't know 100% of everything. You know, even my hospital's limited on what they know, and they're limited on what information they get from the CDC. So just bear it, grin it, go get your vaccine, wear your mask, social distance, and do your best. Stay safe. Most of all, take care of yourself. 
be happy and mentally take care of yourself. Just don't let it get to you. Just say this is a part of life now. It is what it is. I'm not saying this has anything to do with conforming with government. I'm saying this has something to do with taking care of yourself and everybody around you. That's what we all should be doing. All right, I've preached enough. Guys, I got to go to work. I appreciate you guys watching. Um, there'll be more videos on my channel on all kinds of other crazy stuff that I do. Um, I hope you enjoy it. I hope you enjoyed this. And subscribe, like, and all that good crap that goes with it. And I'll be back with you. Y'all have a great day. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.